Christ. Mr. Pete Wishaw. Uh, thank you, Mr. Speaker. Yeah. Can I thank the Leader of the House for announcing the business for next week? Well, last night went well, didn't it? What an anti democratic shambles and utter embarrassment for this House. Just when you thought that this Government couldn't show and demonstrate more contempt for the democratic arrangements of this House, they've gone into that lift and taken us down another couple of levels. I don't know what's going to be next, Mr. Speaker. It might be they'll refuse to answer questions from the dispatch box. Maybe they'll even try to abolish all these inconvenient voting opposition parties. They might even do the country a favour and abolish themselves. But the Leader of the House has to get a grip, and the vacuous nonsense has to stop. She is the leader of all this House, and she has to be, take these responsibilities se yeah. seriously. The first thing she needs to say is that she takes the view of this House seriously. We voted last night to pause the rollout of universal credit. The government have to accept it, and we have to hear that from a DWP minister from this dispatch box. And what about the, the EU repeal bill? It's, it's not all these amendments she talks about, it's because the fractious Conservative Party cannot agree a, a, a solid line on all this, and they're just terrified of any possible defeats. That's why we're not seeing it. And they're, they're talk now that we might not even see the repeal bill much before Christmas. And we have to see it soon. And lastly, Mr Speaker, we're, all getting, we're getting all this talk about a no-deal hard Brexit. These guys are actually serious about putting forward this flavour of disaster. We need to have a debate to see how much this will cost. We know it's going to be Scotland and the northeast of England that's going to be impacted the hardest with a no deal hard Brexit. So, can we have a debate in all this? And lastly, a statement in Catalonia. Perhaps the biggest crisis we've seen in mainland Europe. Talk today of suspending the, the national parliament and repression on the streets. When will we get a statement on this? Yeah.